Hello MechWarriors, how is it going? And welcome to another episode of MechWarrior 5 Mercenaries. We are playing Call to Arms, we are playing the new DLC, and I really want to get, I really want to get a heavy mech, guys. So let's see if we can find one. Let's go ahead and not repair anything, because everything is repaired already. So I'd say we go ahead and seek some trouble, and ideally we're gonna do it down here. It is going to be a little bit of a challenge, but you know what? I'm perfectly fine with that. I'm up to the challenge, and uh, I want to go to a planet where there is a cantina mission and the potential uh, cantina mission mission that we can play and then get the things. All right, let's go. Possible job item. That's what I wanted to say. We will start with a good old-fashioned raid down here. Oh, God. I am... Um, I'm a bit excited, and I'm also a bit afraid of uh, high repair costs and broken mechs. Where we are going... Um, I think we needed a full lance of medium max in order to succeed, but at the same time, we might also find some goodies here. So, checking out the cantina, collect the fire starter. No, we don't have that. Jump jets. That is very doable. Kill warrior units, also very doable. Do we want to drop some of our missions that we have right now? I mean, ground vehicles are always there. Collect jump jets, one out of three. Yes, we can do that. Kill panthers, yes. Collect assassins. Possibly? Yeah, let's just play it as is and then maybe pick up some more. Let's go ahead, play the 57. No, this one here. The 30. Objective raid. <clears throat> That's the one. Get the salvage, as per usual. And since we are playing a raid, we might want to take one of these airstrikes. Sure, why not? Heads up, Commander. Were the conditions mm -hmm. in the 170 out of 200, but I think this is the best squad that we currently have. Unless I want the Javelin here, or the Vindicator. Vindicator brings a bit more armor than the Jenner, but what about the firepower and mobility? I think having one really fast mech is a good idea. So let's go ahead and play it as that. Really want to get a heavy mech. I want to I wanna put a Claymore on... I don't know, I mean on a Highlander obviously, but maybe on a... Grasshopper? Can I carry that Our big of a weapon? Wants us to surgically strike a satellite array at the Mark's location. Once so, done, we'll we're supposed See you soon, to surgically strike Employee that array. Let's go ahead and do that. I mean, position. again, we get that airstrike. There's only one base. I love it. I mean, technically, we can go in with the Jenner and just... Ah, follow me, guys. Uh, and just destroy whatever we are supposed to destroy. But we also need salvage. Yeah, cool. I'm gonna send my people over to this hill, to this little uh, dune, and I'm going to catch the thing. Really good. Man, and this is why I love having a fast light mech here. Just being able to just get the acquisition quickly and then regroup with the team. This is perfect. Uh, oh, urban mech! Alpha 1 1, Sierra 2 1, reporting. Why is this protected? Nobody said it would be protected. Um, God! Yeah, you know what? I'm out of here. I am so out of here. I cannot run! Holy shit! No! <laughs> Surprise, mother flipper. Uh-huh, and then an Igor. Holy damage, Batman. Alright, we're gonna switch to the Hatchet Man here. Let's go. We might lose the Jenner. It's a Rifleman. Urban Mech first. Absolutely. Actually, at this point, on the Rifleman. Because he needs to go. And while we are at it, while we are closing distance... We're gonna give the Urban Mech a casual hit with the axe. Yes! Down he goes. Oh. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Let's actually tear it apart as much as possible. Nice headshot, you say? Not even try, but okay. And we definitely need to take out these tanks. Wow! What a damage! What's wrong with the Jenner? Attack! Come on! Didn't quite hit him. I just wanted to quickly get the thing. Nobody told me that there's resistance. 
Huh? Didn't quite hit. And there's one hit. Not in range yet. Uh, yeah, I mean, this, this Manticore needs to go. Also, component destroyed. Was that something that our friend did or what he received? <laughs> okay, guys. Get the J. Edgar. Yeah, we lost Knuckles and the Medium Laser here. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. The damage report doesn't look great. But hey, there's a Rifleman and it might be on the salvage table. Who are you again? They still have a carrier here. We need to take it down. Ah. Where did it go? That's it. Uh, AC2, that is a an Igor somewhere. I hear the ballistics flying. Where's he at? Huh? I hear ballistics. I heard ballistics. Maybe he's down now. All right, let's go. <laughs> wow. And that is just a side mission. Still hear it. Ah, AC2 is from there. Yeah, I'm gonna ignore that. Come on, guys, come come with me. Just come with me. Targeted. On the move. On your six. Yeah, yeah come to me. You don't need to kill this. Maybe I can. I did. Nice. So follow me, and hopefully we don't die. Blackjack is in horrible condition. The Phoenix Orc is in horrible condition. My mech is not in good condition anymore. And what exactly are we trying to do here? Hmm. Forgot about it. Is this just a satellite dish that we have to destroy? Oh, by the way, I could have dropped an airstrike on these guys earlier. Yeah, it's a dish. We can just do it from here with an airstrike, but I also want to engage this. I want to see if we can maybe find more salvage opportunities. Enemy destroyed. Good job, everybody. Let's take that tank apart, Let's take that tank apart you say. Ooh, that's a panther. And that is a panther down. Alright, we got that. That's it. Hey, hey, hey! Bite me! No, don't go in there, Jenna! Get out! Rip Jenner? I don't know. Hit him down. Hit him with the hatchet. And hit him with the fist. And again. Okay, I think we got this guy. This guy is technically down. I'm already going over to the next target, which is a turret. Yeah, let's go. Kill, kill. And I would say we're gonna get out of here quickly. There might be a reinforcement coming, but my center torso is open, which I don't like. Come on. Let's get out of here. Artillery? What? Um... Ah. Quiet. Not quiet. I know that there are Adi strikes everywhere. And there are people behind us. Mm, Locus, okay. I'm running. Guys, follow me. You know what? Jump to the Jenner and run. I'm out of here. I don't want to pay any more C-Bills to repair my things. Don't engage. Follow me. Come on, come on, come on, we are out. Woohoo! We made it! <laughs> it was a hard fight, but you know what? I love the pressure. It's high risk, and it is high reward. If we can snatch that rifleman, I would be so happy. Reliable? We got the solar cells. There's the rifleman. This is why I hate the economy of the base game. You get something good and you cannot even take a part of it. 
can either take everything or nothing, and in that case, we can take absolutely nothing. Well, well, well. Right. Alright, I was looking for some um, jump jets that we might needed to pick up, but that is it. Alright, we have another medium mech, so that's nice. And honestly, I kind of... I'm okay with the Wolverine, it's an alright mech. Probably better than a Jenner. Okay. Ballistic cooldown, missile range velocity, I like this. So. We can pick up another Cantina mission. What about these jump jets tier 3? We might have them. We have one out of five. Do we just buy them real quick so we are done with this mission and can uh, continue? They are not that expensive. Yeah, I think it is more important to actually get these missions done and there will be a kickback. We will get rewarded for when we turn that in, so that's fine. Supercharger, a Mark IV, or even five into a 90 to 100 ton mech. Hmm. I don't know. We don't have that yet. We don't have that yet. Any other things that we want to buy here? Machine guns, lasers, missiles, nah. Hammer fists. All right. Yeah, that's pretty cool, but doesn't work for us here. So, thanks for the missions. I like it. Um, yeah, I think we have some repairs to do, it seems. 22 days. 18 days. 16 days. And 16 days. But that's okay, because we will go to another planet now. Battlefield. Battlefield. Let's do it, guys. Let's have some fun on the battlefield. Maybe I should have checked the mech market. Because in this uh, conflict zone here, when there's a black market, they might, um, there might be some some good mix. Okay, we got another cantina. Kill spider, pick up things. Yeah, maybe later. We are close to killing ground vehicles. Maybe we can get the jump jets here. Let's see, actually. Um, let's buy equipment. That's two missions done. There we go. Again, I'm perfectly fine to get these done quickly, so I can pick up more Cantina missions and get more things. Uh, getting these reputation uh, points, they are so good. You can upgrade your mechs later. I mean, I'm not doing it on light mechs or mediums. I think as soon as we got heavies, or maybe even the souls, then we're gonna start upgrading them, because I will phase them out, the mechs that we have right now, and it's not worth the investment. But anyway, we can kill spiders. Hmm... Light Rifle Tier 3 or LRM-20 Artemis. I'll take the Artemis. Black Market. Come on. Tell me something. Give me something. I'm looking at these things and I'm uh, instantly seeing that these are very low tier, so I'm not even bothering. This is a Mark IV for a 70 to 85 ton mech. Honestly, I like the Supercharger. It's a very good item, especially for something like a melee mech. And I should probably pick up a 70 to 85 ton mech Supercharger. For the sake of getting that later. Hatchet Man. I don't need another one. I'm not really happy with them. But hey, we can uh, play the mission here and potentially get the thing. Battlefield 37. Oh god. That's it. Yep, that's it. Let's go. 230, we are going in with uh, 170. Uh, and you are still missing your arm. Why? Because you're still in repair. Got it. So let's go ahead and advance the timeline just a little bit. I'm gonna get the Phoenix Hawk done and I take a look at it. Did you get everything back? You did! Alright! Cool. Yeah, the Wolverine, I don't know if you're gonna get it. It'll probably take an arm and a leg to repair that thing, right? Two million seabills, base cost. It'll be upgraded to 3.2 million. I don't know. I'd rather buy a heavy mech. Again, it is a nice mech. It's an, it's an okay thing to have. Not the best, not the worst. But uh, I do believe it's too costly to repair that thing. Let's skip this. Skip it altogether. 
Doesn't make sense. Okay, let's go ahead, play the next mission, and I think we will go in just like that. Let's not get wrecked. I think in a mission like this, the Hatchet Man is the, my priority uh, pick. To pick it up. Commander, enemy forces will inevitably overrun this area, but we have been tasked with holding them back for as long as possible. We have substantial combat bonus opportunities the longer you can... Where's the thing? Off. But be sure not to overextend yourself. I don't see the thing. Rihanna told me that there's a thing. Oh, it's right on me? Alright, I'll pick it up. Is this our mission? Cargo acquired. Or is this a random thing? Also, what is that? Yeah, we, we recovered a, a laser. Anyway. Battlefield it is. We just gotta get close and then the fight will start. Hmm, interesting. Good old war zone, I like that. You know, it's just so simple. Enemies come to you, you destroy them. Next enemy wave comes to you, you destroy them, you go home. That's it. I'm a simple man. I like explosions. 200 meters and the fun will start now. It's a big open plaza here. I don't know if I want to fight here. Also, what the hell is that? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, weird. And there is no indication that we can find our mission objective here on this planet. On this ah, map. It's one of the more tanks. Destroy it. We have a bunch of Manticores and Partisans coming in. Ooh. Fun fact. Yesterday in my D&D session, I fought a Manticore. And it almost killed us. <laughs> Fourth level party. And then they had some other things as well, so that was kind of scary. Bad news, Commander. More hostiles inbound on your position. Get yeah, I wanna company. probably stay away. Not a good shot. Mm, this is where the big, the big birds are coming. So close, man. Okay, let's stay on the ground vehicles, and then go for the flyers later. Still not. Insane. That's the Igor. I want to stay on the Manticore. Uh, actually, party's on here. Did I hit this? I don't know. Ow. Get wrecked. There we go. You ask, why am I not punching this thing with my hatchet? Because it will explode and that explosion will deal splash damage to my mech. And I don't like that. We gotta be careful. We have the mechs though, huh? I'm here to get some salvage. There we go. I think with the mechs we go into hand-to-hand -hand combat. This is what we are designed for. Stay with me, guys. Stay with me. It's important. We gotta work as a team if we wanna win. Another loot thing on the right side. Hunchback needs to go. Um, yeah, I'm going in. I'm going in. Maybe I shouldn't. I wanna fight 1v1, not all v me. Good. One side is down. God, that's so many hunchies. We gotta do some hit and run stuff here. Yep. It's my back. Uh oh. Hi! I need that side also to go instantly. Yes! AC20 is down. On the next target. He's still punching me. It's like a whole squad of hunchbacks. All of them are. Headshot, not bad. I'm gonna run minimum distance. Let's go for another headshot here. If we can. Ooh. That's my right side. A hatchet man without a hatchet is just a man. Yeah, hatchet is down. Uh, auto cannon is still intact. I cannot shoot it though. I cannot shoot my auto cannon. 
for some reason. Now I can again. All right. Hunchback is down. Now on to the other one. This is not great. But okay. Again, I was going in for a challenge. I got the challenge. The hatchet man will fall. For some reason, the Jenner is completely inactive here. I'm pinned. And I'm down. All right. All right, Jenner action. Let's do it. Down goes the hunch boy. Ah, frantic fire. Ooh, I planned that shot. Yeah, I did. It was a headshot, but I didn't really plan on going for it. I wanted to get the center to also down. Wow. Uh-huh. Um, that's fine. So we have five more enemies. There's a dropship in this area. Oh, wait, there was also some acquisition, right? Where was it again? Like here? Here. Okay, got it. I think I got it. Uh, uh, it's a crap. Ooh, 27 SL. Oh my god, the value. Another hunch boy. I'll disengage from this. We gotta take the tanks before anything else. Okay, um, now on... I mean, the crab is the most dangerous. Let's try to take it. And we are aggressive. Ah! On the leg. On the center? Maybe it's center here. This guy is very well equipped. Where? Where? What? I'm, I'm confused. What? <laughs> Try to hit center. We are here for the salvage. Ah uh ah -uh ah. -uh. Uh -uh. Stay in his back. Got him. Now, one hunchback and one tank, and we are good to go. And our hunchback, luckily, so it's no AC20. That would be very devastating for my little Jenna boy here. I'm stuck. All right. Disengaging. I'm back. Did you miss me, honey? Oh, no, no, no. You don't punch me. You don't punch me. Okay. Headshot. That's not a lucky shot, boy. So, the last target is a tank, which is actually quite good. Now we can take that and then uh, run back to our evac, which is beyond the tank's spawn or current position. Let's go. Take it and then run away. Ooh, what a heavy mission today. This is cool as hell. Try again. Lasers. And we're done. Yeah. Let's get out of here. Instantly. The good news is the, hun uh, the hunchback, the blackjack, didn't really get hurt. And the Phoenix Orc is also in good condition. We had just have to rebuild our friend, the Hatchet Man. It is okay. Man, I like these high stakes missions. It's really cool. Get a bit of money. I'll take it. I will 100% take that. Oh my god, that is insanely good. The Hunchbakes are also insanely good, by the way. Um, but this one here, I think, comes with double heat sinks, right? Comes with large pulses. I mean, this is a no-brainer. I will take the crap 27 SL. Yeah, there is a double heat sink here. Sadly, we cannot pick it. Um, but the crap should have some. Cool, cool, cool. And I'm gonna take an LRM-10, because why not? Alrighty, guys, we just got a crab. 
That is insanely good. Look at this. Yes, they are the doubles. Uh, it also has double heat sinks in the core, which is really good. This is broken, sadly. But hey. Um... Yeah, I don't know. I think we can actually play it as is. Just armor. It is armored up already. <laughs> All right. So we just bring two pulses and two medium lasers. Bunch of heat sinks. That's a build. No, this is a little bit missing. Front is a bit missing. We're going to fix that. We're going to make this happen. It's a beautiful 50 ton mech and it is ours now. So next big thing. Uh, I'm not going to repair that here. That would be dumb. Um, hmm. Don't really want to go to Gunsburg again, but I think it's the closest. Yeah, it is. I really want to get that crab online. It's gonna be a game changer for us. With the crab in our lands now, we can easily play these missions. Easily. The question is, do I drop the large pulses to something like large lasers, saving four tons and get more cooling? It's a Kestrel Lancer thing, right? So if I accept that, am I bound to it? Will not last forever. Yep. Um, anyway, I'm here to buy some things. Mac Market tells me that there is a Hunchback 4G. Okay. There is a Hunchback 4G. This is not a bad mech per se. But I wanted to buy heavies. I'm not gonna buy mediums, right? No, let's not do that. Let's go ahead, take a look at the equipment. There's an assault claymore and katana and so on and so on. Again, nothing that we can buy yet. But we can build things. All right, Mr. Krabs, let's go. Repair, do that. We have small lower arms, like one on the right side and then a medium hand on the left side. So we can Huh, pincer enemies. Medium pulse can go. Ooh, what's that? This is weird. Okay. Um, let's go for some... Medium lasers on the center, right? Armor up. There we go. Distribution is, is fine, I would say. It's okay. Mm, drop a bit from the head. There we go. All right. So two medium lasers, two large pulse lasers. It is already very good. The rest of the mech. What's it going to be? Also, we have a medium laser tier two. Might as well use it, huh? I'm still contemplating the large lasers compared to the large pulses. The pulses have better DPS. The large lasers have better range. 500, 675. These would be better to take down enemy flyers. This would be better in a brawl. I don't know. So this would be our cooling. This is good. We can try. You know what? We're gonna make our decision on the battlefield. Two million seabills easily spend. And the question is, what to do with the hatchet man? We lost a hatchet. We have a claw here. 32 damage. Hmm. I still wonder what the claw brings compared to the hatchet. Hatchet is 3 ton, 40 damage. 20 meters max range. This is 4 tons, 32 damage. I don't, I don't get it. And it's a tier 2 compared to a tier 1. Uh, medium knuckles. They can go here. Ah, okay. So wait. The medium hand actuator deals 15 base damage. It actually tells you. Interesting. Medium mace. 52 damage. Let's check that out, shall we? It's a bit heavier. Mm, but we can easily shave a single heat sink, I think. Let's check out the mace. It's not a hatchet man anymore, it's now a mace man. And I think I'm ready to go. Let's go ahead and go back to where we potentially find our cargo. Targeted kill? Seems good. Let's go. We're gonna bring the Brawly Boys. Crab, the Hatchet Man, the Blackjack S Fire Support, that's fine. And probably the Phoenix Arc. Brings a bit more tonnage, brings a bit more armor in general. I like that. 
So, here we go. 22. Oh, easier. Nice. Still here for the salvage and the money. Actually, with a targeted kill, we might get the Nair Strike out. Heads up, Commander. Weather conditions in Bam. the area will restrict visibility. Seems good, man. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Actually, am I? I need somebody with real good energy proficiency. Like... You. Yeah, you're better off on the crab. That's fine. With five out of six. Seems good. Do we have anybody better? Five out of eight? Alright. Let's do that. I cannot change the commander, by the way. But yeah, that's cool. Let's get the crab online. And then, of course, I want to check the mace. And I want to see how it feels. Alrighty. Hangar doors open. Stand clear. Reactor online. Sensors online. I think the next Reactor mech that I'm gonna online. phase out is the Phoenix Hawk. I don't really like it. Four bases. Alright. One of the mock's locations on the map. Once you neutralize them, head to the evac point for extraction. Our employer has okayed the use of airstrike on this mission. Stand by for strike uh, operation. Yeah, alright. Walk on up to the treasure to pick it up. It is still a lot of heat that we generate. Ooh. Ready to start pickup operation. So I think our sustain is not gonna be good. Intel puts one of our targeted acquisitions somewhere in this location. Oh, okay, we gotta keep our eyes open. What's he doing there? Alright. Uh, yeah, we will get there eventually. That's fine. It's actually on our path. So let's go ahead and take this base. Then we go to the center of the map. And then we're gonna move right. And then go through the canyon. Yeah, I know. Um, I should probably take care of the garrison though. Because they might backstab us. Also, we gotta think about the salvage. Not bad at all. <laughs> the tank had a seizure. There's another one in there. Somewhere here. There it is. It is a big, big carrier. But he's down. So, next base. We move through the canyon. It's a big map. There might be a lot of stuff happening here. And somebody is not getting into position. The blackjack is kind of stuck, seemingly. Um, but I think I have enough fire support here anyway. Hello? I'm home. Honey! Come on, do you have cookies? Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to wait for everybody now. Coming, guys. There's a blackjack in the base and something else. I think I saw a tank. What? There it is. There's the jack. Big hit in the center. Got that? Really need to watch my heat, but cooldown is ready. And so is the Jack. Nice. What? Was there a tank falling from the sky? Yeah, that was that base. Let's keep going, let's keep pushing. <laughs> let's go, guys. Yes, the tank. Out of range. Oh, I completely missed, I don't know. So yeah, next thing is hitting the sky. Beautiful. And then going for whatever we can find here. What's that? What is that? Sneaky cicada, huh? Get out of here. Got him. 
I mean, the cooling is quite okay. We are building up quite a good chunk of heat. But again, the cooling is quite nice. Another Cantina mission done. I'm so happy with that. Yeah, let's go. Um, uh, gotta go through here, though. Alright. And then up the hill. Up to the next base and then to the last one. It might actually be that... We will find our target at the very last base. But again, it's okay. We negotiated for quite a good chunk of salvage. Might as well destroy some more things. And we also need to keep in mind, on a targeted kill mission, there will be a dropship coming after we have destroyed... Uh-huh. After we have destroyed the target. I'll wait for the people here. Charging in now will destroy my crap. I don't want that. Ready, boys? Let's go! Alright. Nice laser wash through the center and again. Alright, we got that guy. Ow. Oh my god. You're going in? Enjoy! That's a Shadowhawk 2K. Oh my god. Can I have it? There's also a Griffin. Uh-huh. Hey, Griffin, stop doing that. Yeah, go for me. I don't know what we did to the Hawk, but... The Trebuchet is getting downed. Getting hot. Ah, not quite. That last one wasn't quite good. There we go. Single-handedly, destroy the Griffin. That's it, the friends will arrive, but however... Mm, he dodged it. He completely dodged it. Another one. A hawk. Next strike! Surprise! And we got him. No, we didn't! Wake up! Ah! There's a lot of damage on the board now. Um, what to prioritize? I honestly don't know. I need to cool anyway, so that's fine. Hey. Stop it! What's going on with the Phoenix Hawk, man? Come on, Phoenix, do your thing! Which is shooting enemies. Again, too much. I need to learn the heat management of this. I'm getting carried away with the brawls because I'm under pressure. He's down, alright. He's ejecting. Yeah, let's go. Blackjack is taking a substantial amount of damage, but that's fine. I'm waiting for cooling so I can attack twice. And I want to be in his back. Taking out the PPC, that's important. Mm. Take that while we're at it. Hey, buddy. Can I have your peep? Oh, God. More tanks. Um, yeah. Quick punch. Uh, an SRM carrier. Got him. So, anything else I want to destroy, potentially? Not really. Let's get out of here. Let's get the hell out of here. The blackjack took way too much damage. There we go. Follow me! Ooh. Actually, we should probably take off the carrier. Copy, targets confirmed. Can you do it, guys? Yeah, now we go. Alright, so. I think I'm actually on the fastest mech that we have here. Maybe next to the Phoenix Hawk. But since I'm ahead of the Phoenix Hawk, I'm just gonna keep using my crab. Yeah, you can even shoot while moving. Perfect. That was a good fight. I would say it was right in our danger bracket. And while the blackjack took damage all over, there's no critical component. Cool. Nice mission. These Shadowhawks actually gave me a little bit of uh, trouble. When I saw them, I'm like, yeah, they have armor. They have a good chunk of armor. And if you don't take care of them, they will just tear you apart with their PPCs over time. And then the Griffin as well. 
There was a good chunk of 55 toners here. We got a nice large chemical lasers. I like it. Really good. And all I get is a panther. Come on. So many cool 55 toners. Alrighty. I'm gonna sell that thing. But hey, we killed ground vehicles. Perfect. And we collected things. We now have an LRM-20 Artemis. And potent warheads. 5% more missile damage. It's pretty good. Alright. Repair cost is minimal. The Panther is gonna get sold instantly. Oh, wait, what? Collect Assassin, kill Panther. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So we can sell it easily. I was looking at the, the green little icon here and I'm like, wait, this is a, a mission objective? But yeah, we should just destroy them. Bam. There he goes. Click repair button on everybody else. And I would say, guys, looking at the time, this is a perfect time to make a cut here. I hope you enjoyed the episode. And as always, if you did, don't forget to leave a rating. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. If you want to help me out a little bit, drop a super thanks down below. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.